Hi everyone, Kellen here with Astro Optics. I recently acquired this new scope for my 243 hunting rifle. It's an older rifle, but it'll make do. I thought we'd come out to the range today together and sight it in and also use our HBX 1600B to see if we can get some accurate MOA adjustments as we move further down the range. Let's get into it. So now we're just about sighted in. I'm gonna go ahead and move my shooting platform back to about 200 yards, where I know that this 243 round is gonna drop about three and a half inches, but I'm gonna let the binoculars tell me that to see what I need to adjust these chirps for. Now, one thing I'd like to note here while I'm shooting is that even if you don't have a rifle scope that has these three turrets or exposed turrets, or all these different forms of easy adjustments, you can still take full advantage of the built-in ballistics modes of these Astroptics HBX 1600s. That's because all those rifle sights are gonna have either MOA or MIL adjustments, and you can still get those readings from here and adjust them to your liking. Maybe that won't be as easy while you're out on the hunt, you might have to unscrew some turrets, but you can still take advantage of this at the range very easily. So now that we're down here in our new shooting spot, after I've sighted this in to the best of my abilities, I'm not the best shooter in the world, I'm gonna take my Astro Optics HBX 1600s, which I already have set up for this ammunition type, which in my case is gonna be Ballistics Group 5.1 because I chose to sight my rifle in at 100 yards. And we're gonna acquire our target and range it. We have 203.4. A good guess on my part, moving back to shooting platform. Nice. It's, let's double check here. We have a 1.6 MOA adjustment upwards. So after that, I'm gonna get ready to shoot. We're gonna go 1.6, which every quarter of these clicks is, every click is a quarter MOA. We have one, two, three, so I'm moving up 1.5 MOA instead of the 1.6, and I'll try to accommodate for that the best I can as I'm just aiming myself. See how we did. Pretty darn close. You'll notice I'm able to use these Astro Optics HBX binoculars with my shooting glasses still on, and that's because of our pupillary range. So you can really use these in any conditions and be set up to go. So with my targets about 200 yards down range, which I would not have known about without the use of this rangefinder. I'd be stuck here sitting, shooting high, aiming two inches high, aiming two inches low, trying to guess the trajectory of my bullet, likely with no avail or great accuracy in the process. But the HBX 1600B or any of our other handheld laser rangefinders that incorporate the built-in ballistics mode, I was able to input my bullet type, range my target successfully and accurately, which is important, and then be provided with the correct MOA adjustments that I need to continue shooting, even if I were to move all the way down this road out to 800 meters. That's a little bit further than I want to do today, or it's past my abilities, to be honest, but it's there when you need it, which is the great thing about these Astro products. So there you have it. I just want to do a quick demonstration of how our binoculars with the built-in ballistics, ballistics mode can be a great companion while you're at the range or hunting. I am by no means a long range or a competitive shooter, but I can still take advantage of this system. And it's a system that I wish I had growing up so that I could learn on it to be a more proficient hunter and shooter in the process. You saw today that I used a Remington Model 700 243 Winchester rifle, likely a little bit too small for me at this point. 
But with this scope, it made a great accessory pair and I was able to hit my targets at a pretty long range, which I wouldn't have been able to do just guessing and checking it ordinarily. If you guys need any more tutorials or anything like that, please don't hesitate to reach out, let me know. Tell me what type of content you wanna see. I'd be more than happy to generate it for you, answer any questions, things like that. Thanks for watching.